Hey guys, this is Tech Pocket, and today I'm gonna show you how to make your old Apple device with iOS 8 or iOS 7 to run faster and stop making the application shut down. So let's get started. The reason that this happens is because your Apple device doesn't have enough space of RAM to move on. The basic thing to turn off every app the background that makes your RAM fill is to double press your home button of your Apple device. And here you will see the batch of apps that you have opened recently. To close them, just like press on an app and slide it down up. Do the same on every application that you have. Now all the apps that you had recently opened are closed. But this, this is not enough. If your Apple device still runs low and some apps doesn't open or some apps actually shut down unexpectedly, just hold down the power button, the home button to do a hard uh, boot up of your device. Don't worry about that. Your application or your photos or videos on any data of your device won't get lost but this will be a hard reset of your RAM if it still doesn't uh, respond or some apples apps closed unresponsibly just go on the app store and download an app called battery doctor it looks like this Go ahead on App Store and download this app. Should be the first app on your search. Now close App Store and open Battery. If you can't find Battery Doctor, make sure to switch from app iPad apps to iPhone apps. Then you should find the app. And it's free. So here you will see how much battery uh, capacity you have or how much memory you have used or how many uh, space you have in your iPad or iPhone or iPod or some free apps to download, optimize and a bunch of uh, stuff and options here. So we're going to focus on the memory. So click on the memory used and click on boost. Now, Battery Doctor should detect or scan every app in the background that's possible to stop its uh, working and free up RAM. What you're gonna do? Just press on the boost button and battery will boost your RAM and your device as much as they can. So here it says that uh, it freed up three 41 megabytes that's actually much and now you have 32 percent of memory used and now your apple device should run very smoothly make sure to press the boost button uh, very recently because if you have ios 8 and you have an ipad mini for generation ipad 2 ipad 3 or even ipod touch 5 or iphone 4s you should free up your ram capacity as often as you can but you have a version of Apple device higher than this model that I just told basically these devices have only one gigabyte of RAM but iPad mini all this stuff have only 512 gigabyte megabytes so actually does need to do it that much often so that was the video for today guys I hope you enjoyed I hope you learned something new today. Please subscribe to my channel, watch my latest videos, my latest tutorials. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter and like my Facebook fan page to watch my latest videos, my latest tutorials, also my latest activities. Thanks for watching guys and I hope you have a beautiful day.